Truck bed campers, love them or hate them, they're making a comeback on a grand scale. I'm Reacher, and here are 10 truck bed campers currently making their mark in the industry. Number 10. This first entry from German-based Camp Crown is the primary offering of what a truck bed camper should be. The rooftop raises at an angle toward the front, providing extra living space and protection from the elements. When it's lowered, the low-profile design allows for a safe, cost-efficient driving experience. At just under 9 feet in length, with an 8.5 foot ceiling, it offers plenty of headroom with a living area that includes a sink, a hideaway cassette toilet, a U-shaped dinette that converts to extra bedding, and a twin bed in the cab over. Number 9. The Cirrus 820 from Ohio-based New Camp is one of two hard side short bed cab over models the company currently offers. Coming in at just over 2,500 pounds and 17 feet long, it sports an all-aluminum framework with an aluminum and fiberglass shell. The interior is no slouch in its design either, employing a layout that has a lengthy kitchenette and fridge along one side while opposite that is a booth-style dinette. Hidden out of the way near the entrance is a fully enclosed wet bath with a fold-up sink and a wall-mounted shower head. The cab over offers three and a half feet of headroom as well as space for a queen-size mattress. Rounding out the mix are large windows all around, including a skylight above the bed. Number 8. Although it doesn't look like your traditional truck bed camper, this entry from Outback Campers functions in the same way by sliding onto the vehicle and having the option to use as a standalone unit. The roof raises at an angle, revealing a queen size sleeper, while a panel on the rear folds down to create a raised floor for added space. Below the bed, you'll find plenty of storage space as well as a slide out kitchen and refrigerator. In addition to this, an awning can be extended from the side along with the option of a tent that can be attached to increase the living area. The rugged design, low center of gravity, and light weight of 1,100 pounds make it perfect for the extreme off-road crowd. I think it goes without saying that the all-black paint scheme on this one is as simple as it gets. The interior, on the other hand, is a stark contrast, having no shortage of modern amenities. Each one comes standard with features such as a kitchenette that includes a stovetop cooker, sink, fridge, and microwave. There's also a dinette or couch that converts to extra sleepers as well as a full or queen-size bed located in the cab over. Currently offered in seven layouts for half-ton pickups, the Superlight measures from just over 10 feet to 12 and a half feet in length with a starting dry weight of 1,100 pounds. Number six. The weight and size of this one create the perfect camper for a half ton to three quarter ton pickup truck with a six and a half to eight foot bed. It measures in at 16 feet in length and seven feet in width with a dry weight of 2,100 pounds. It houses a kitchenette with a sink, a triple burner cooktop, a microwave and three way fridge. Across from that is a dinette with bench seating that can be converted to an extra bed if needed. In the back by the entrance is a fully enclosed wet bath. The extended cab over area includes a closet, a queen size bed, space for a TV, and extra storage along both sides. Number 5. This full size triple slide out can fit all the features of home, including the kitchen sink. 
Measuring 8 feet wide and just over 19 feet long with a dry weight of 3,900 pounds, it's made for trucks that usually have the word dually in the name. The side entry floor plan has a rear slide out containing the couch and an optional wardrobe. The other two slide outs are on each side of the camper, one housing a U-shaped dinette that seats up to four people and the opposite one having a kitchenette. Moving forward is the bathroom which has a separate full-size stand-up shower. The cab over provides the main sleeping area with four layout options for a queen or a king size bed. Number 4. I just want to point out that this one is a borderline beast of a camper. It measures in at 9 feet high, 20 feet in length, 8 feet in width, and it has a dry weight of just over 3,600 pounds. And like the previous entry, you probably won't be hauling this one on anything smaller than a dually. Two slide-out sections on opposite sides of the camper increase the living space, which includes a dinette area with bench seating and a kitchenette with a three-burner range, oven, and refrigerator. The cab over area has a queen size bed, an entertainment system, and a closet with mirrored doors. The camper offers sleeping space for up to four people using the dinette, which converts to a bed as well. There's also a dry bath that has a toilet, sink, and a private stand-up shower. Number three. This unique design is made for flatbed trucks instead of the conventional pickup truck. This allows the owner to use their vehicle for work as well as recreation with the added option of a tent on top. Like the previous entry at number eight, this one has a powder coated all aluminum body that has a large compartment on each side. The setup can be customized to the user's needs with options like a slide out kitchen, a mini fridge, and a rooftop mounted tent. It comes standard with a 100 watt solar panel and a 135 amp hour battery, LED lighting throughout, and a massive 1,150 liter storage area. Number two. Another one from a German-based manufacturer, the Tischer Trailbox 260S is one that can fit both a single and double cab vehicle easily. The aluminum body has an overall length of 20 feet and a width of 7 feet. The interior height is 6.5 feet, allowing more than enough headroom for the average person. The floor area includes a centrally located U-shaped dinette along with a small kitchenette on one side and the refrigerator on the other. The cab over has room for a queen size bed that can be set up front to back or side to side as needed. Opposite the side door entrance is an enclosed wet bath that has a fold up sink and swiveling toilet providing more room to maneuver. A variety of windows and skylights provide plenty of natural light creating the impression of a space much larger than it actually is. We had this one in a recent video and I couldn't help but sneak it in here. I can't begin to tell you how much I personally love the look and the layout of the Kimbo 6, but as I said before, if I were to buy a truck bed camper, this would be the one. I'll put the link to the other video in the description below for those that want to give it a more in-depth look. Number 1. This final entry has everything you need for a trip of just about any length and any destination. The body is composed of a molded fiberglass composite and it comes in at just over 26 feet long, 7.5 feet wide with a total height of 11 feet. Features include a kitchenette with an induction cooktop, sink, refrigerator, and microwave. 
Across from that is a dinette that doubles as an extra sleeping area if needed. The main sleeping area, which fits a king-size bed, is housed in the cab over. There's also an enclosed wet bath and an optional hideaway mini washing machine in the rear, along with a small entry that allows access to the camper directly from the cab of the vehicle. Wrapping it all up is an 850-watt roof-mounted solar array that provides power to a 20-kilowatt-hour battery bank. 